I am so excited right now because I have discovered some amazing new products that literally have been changing my life. Like these are my new obsessions that I've been obsessing over. So I think let's just dive into these eight obsessions. But before we get started, let me know in the comments, like what has been your obsession? Please let me know because like, honestly, I will probably buy it. Um, so yeah, let me know in the comments. So the first product is this. This is from Face Reality. This is the Hydra Balance Hydrating Gel. Face Reality is known for amazing like acne clearing stories and like those photos on Instagram. Um, Face Reality is like a natural brand. Um, and I got this from my optician, which is like a facial person. Um, I love getting facials now, which is actually, it's so fun. I was not even expecting it. I, oh, it was amazing. But she recommended this to me. She used it, it when I was in there and I'm like, oh my gosh, what smells so good. And literally this is the best smelling gel ever. It's slightly green, but it's not really green. It, the first, no, the first ingredient is aqua, but actually water is really good for your skin. And then there's aloe, orange peel extract, honeysuckle extract, witch hazel, um, some kind of barks from trees and just a lot of tea extracts. Um, so that's the reason why it's slightly green, but when you blend it into your skin, it literally feels like you're rubbing in water. Like that sounds like really weird, but like a thick water and it just gives you this natural glow and it just really like, that's not what I'm wearing, it's my glow, I will show you that. Um, but I really enjoy it, I highly recommend it. It's only 18 bucks and you can get this on, I think, I think I'll try to link everything, but um, you can get this at really any facial place. Oh, I'm really obsessing with it. I just use it as my um, moisturizer in the morning, moisturizer at night, and my primer. So it's kind of just in my little like depuffer and just de acne here. What? Does that make sense? I don't know. I feel like it does help and hydrate. The next product I am so obsessed with. I think you guys, you can kind of see. So this is from, oh my gosh, am I going to be able to pronounce the name? It's like Lum Luminaire? Luminaire. Luminaire? I think something like that. But it's a little squeezy tube concealer. And this is the moisturizing mineral foundation concealer uh and i got it in the shade porcelain i love this so much this is what i use to cover my pimples because it's really really lightweight so it won't clog anything like you know it won't like get anything too stuck in there and it's hypoallergenic which is awesome it's really really natural and there is a little sunblock in here but it's natural sunblock i really just love it um it's a very creamy creamy formula like it just it's so amazing i really like the moisturizing formula because i like a lot of hydration um because i hate when my skin gets all crackly so this concealer definitely like smooths over it and i just i really like it and it just does not break me out if anything it's been helping with my breakouts so um if you've been wanting a concealer that's kind of natural to cover your pimples because you don't want to put like unnatural things on your pimples so you you know you break out more or if it doesn't heal that fast so um yeah i really have been enjoying this i highly recommend it to you oh my gosh look at my nails don't they look horrible well they don't look that bad actually i've been picking off my gel nails i just need to get them removed but <laughs> ignore that um but i really love this and i'll try to link it below so love it then i found this cream blush actually they sent it to me but this is not sponsored um this is from 100 percent pure this is the cherry lip and cheek little um tint and it is amazing i really really like it because i just dab it on my cheeks and it really blends out super super easily this is what i'm wearing as my flush i'm also wearing not my flush i always call it that blush what's well, kind of kind of rhymes blush blush um but that's what i'm wearing under another thing but this is like my like everyday thing i just swipe it on my lips almost every day this is what i'm wearing on my lips right now now um it just kind of gives you like that hydration and just like a very natural flush and this is in the shade cherry really like it because it just kind of alivens you if you will sometimes i even put it on my eyelids it's like not too red then i have been so obsessed with this i know this is expensive i know i know i know but i really do like this this is amazing this is what i'm wearing as my glow to like do you see are you seeing this are you seeing this I am so obsessed with it. It's intense, but wet and so glowy. I have it like on my chin too. I love it so much. This is the Dior, uh, what is it called? Nude Skin Illuminizer. And I just, I love the packaging so much. I love the highlighter and this is in the shade 01. I just, ah, uh, it's so gorgeous. Like on the hand, it's not, like it doesn't even slightly give it justice. Um, that, well, that was a bad swatch too. But like, it's so gorgeous when you put it on. It just like, oh, uh, I did a first impression on it yesterday, I believe. Um, yeah, and I just, I'm so obsessed with it. I just like, I can't get enough. And it doesn't exaggerate texture, which is amazing love it especially for like a like a high-end product great to ask like for christmas and your birthday and just all of it like just oh i really like it so much 
Then I have been really enjoying, I know this has a lot of controversy because it's like the Jaclyn Hill palette, which is so true, it is. Um, so if you already have the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm probably like, skip on this, but I didn't get it and I really love Jaclyn Hill, but I love Chrissy too. She's just like the cutest little thing. I just, ah, so cute. Her cheeks just, uh, and she came out with like, a cheek palette. I'm like, oh my gosh, I need this. And I really, really like it. I use it as kind of my blush because this palette is definitely darker. I will say like, if you have deeper skin tone, oh my gosh, this is gonna be so, on you as a highlight it's like a beautiful peachy highlight um so i really do like that about that so it's like good for almost all skin tones i really like it for my like mm, medium fair medium skin um it's not too i'm like i'm okay Lee tan i feel like my hand is always so much darker than my face i wish my hand and my face matched but they don't but this really does i really like it this is what i'm wearing as my blush on top of the um uh 100 pure little cheek and lip tint so i put that on which kind of gives me that really natural radiance and then um because this is like a little like it's like a, my bait not a base but like it gives it like this nice like pigment so like when you put this on top it just gives you like this like oh so i really like it because it just kind of gives you like this glow to right here but like it also like just plumps up your cheeks i feel like it looks like chrissy Teigen's cheeks like her cheeks are so cute and chubby um so really like this the bronzer i really like for eyeshadow i haven't used the bronzer all over the face i haven't really been using a lot of bronzer um but i really enjoy just all of the shade i like pretty much all of well actually i like the shade too in the eyes not in the eyes Ugh, no but uh on the crease and this is only $46, and one of their single little things, um, like one of their single highlighters or single blushes, is like $38, $36. So you get a lot in here for $46. It's only like $10 bucks more, and you get like four more products. It's awesome. I really like it. I just realized I was like completely singing. I don't know why I like do that. I swear, like, I don't notice I'm singing until like I watch me back. I'm like, what am I doing? Anywho, uh, I have the little baby and I have the big baby. I first heard about this from, um, I was gonna say from Anastasia. No, this is from Anastasia. This is the clear brow gel. Um, uh, Jaclyn Hill loves this. I love her eyebrows most of the time. Sometimes they're a little filled in, but honestly that happens to me too, so it's okay. But I was like, oh my gosh, her eyebrows look so separated. So I have just been obsessed with this. I got this with a gift with purchase. I believe I bought the Anastasia Glow Kit, which is amazing, um, but Yes, uh, I got a little gift with purchase and I used this pretty much up. So I bought the big guy and I love it so much. It also was amazing. What was that? Oh, it was a text. That was a loud one. But it's just so amazing for separating and setting each individual eyebrow hair. It kind of just makes everything look a little sheerer and a little more sharp. Because sometimes I feel like I go a little ham with my, I can't find it right now, but my Anastasia brow widths and I'm like, ugh, it's a little too much. So I just like, I go in with another brow gel, but then it kind of just, gets even more bold and I'm like uh, uh, uh. so I really like this because it kind of shears it out and almost removes the excess and makes it a little more feathery and a little more like natural so I really like the Anastasia clear brow gel awesome for just throwing in your brows and kind of just separating if you get what I mean so a few days ago I went to my mall and I bought the Guerlain mascara this is okay let me grab the box this is the um one that I bought, and I didn't mean to, I'll kind of tell you, but um, see, this is what it looks like. You can probably screenshot it, I'm not even sure how to pronounce this, um, but it's the black and silvery gold in the middle. I was actually getting the whole, I wanted to get, because I'm not making any sense, but I wanted to get the whole entire gold bar one, but I thought that, that that's the one I thought I got, but I, yeah, it's kind of a long story. I She got me the wrong box, and I was like, oh, she knows, it's fine, whatever. Um, I just trusted her and everything. Uh, nothing like wrong with it, you know, like the boxes kind of do look the same. So, um, yeah, I didn't mean to get this one, but I'm so glad I did. Everything happens for a reason, I swear by that. But look how long and individualized my lashes are. Like, do you, are you seeing this? I love it. It's so, like, amazing. I just, I, I can't, it never clumps, it never smudges. I literally went to this insane workout. I sweated so much and it didn't even budge. I'm not even kidding, like it's amazing, but it's kind of easy to remove. So it's really just perfect, and it gives you so much length and volume, and I've been getting a lot of compliments on it. So yeah, that really never happens too. So I'm like, girl on, you got me. So 
yeah and lastly this is amazing if you're like me and I just I don't like putting on sunblock because it's super goopy and it just never looks really good it just looks really white on me and it just I don't like it and unnatural sunblocks break me out so this is a natural brush on SPF from mineral fusion you can get this at Whole Foods really any health food store that you have um, it has a little brush and can you see all that little dust that's coming out that's sunblock I don't want to look white. I don't want to look all greasy and white and gross. I want just a basic sunblock that gives me sunblock and protection. You know what I mean? So I really love this for summer. Just, I, I throw one in my bag. I just, I love them because it's so easy. It's brush on and it's natural. So yeah, I love it. Those were my obsessions recently. I just, I really have been liking how my makeup has been turning out. Um, less freckles, are you happy? <laughs> no, um, but yep a doodle That is my obsessions that I highly recommend to you. Thank you so much for watching and 